January 6th has become shorthand for something much, much bigger. And I think that's the challenge for anybody reality-based, Democrats, moderates, independents, Chris Christie, anybody in the reality-based world. We've got to make clear that we're talking, when we say January 6th, about something that actually built up for months and months and months. Ultimately, this is about the entire Trump presidency. And what went wrong on January 6th is because of what went wrong in those months and even years beforehand. So when you talk about what Fox was saying in the lead up to January 6th, Frankly, I think it's been grossly overlooked. I think it's been dramatically overlooked. That rhetoric uh, from Mark Levin, from Janine Pirro saying, we need to fight, we need to do what the Revolutionary War soldiers did, right? What our ancestors did. That was incredibly incendiary in the days leading up to this attack. And yes, we know that some rioters bought plane tickets and flew to Washington because of what they were being told on television, because of the lies that were being spread on television. So I think it's an underappreciated part of the story.